Okay, I decided to start using um, screening material on the smaller seeds instead of the felt. Um, the problem with the felt is it held a lot of water and it did create um, some mold in my finer seeds. So I'm trying the screening method. Um, it seems to work very well for Brent. Uh, and so I'm going to try it. I soaked these um, seeds overnight. They're still wet. I had a heck of a time getting them out of my container and draining them. But I drained them. I just poked some holes in the lid. And it slowly drained. I didn't want to lose any seeds, so I had to keep the holes tiny. And that's fine. And um, the screen has been washed. The... 10 by 10 has been washed and as you can see from soaking them overnight uh, most of them have already sprouted um, I took my handy dandy little spatula it's a tiny one and very carefully moved the seeds um, spread them all across the screen as good as I could I didn't want to overwork it because I didn't want to hurt the sprouts that are there and so this is going to get covered and put into my system. Be right back. So I'm going to drain this one. This is broccoli seeds. I know some people just um, look at that. It's really slow drip there. But that's okay. Um, they just wet their seeds on their medium. Um, but I'm not going to do that with this one. I just want to get them drained and put them on the screen. I have another one prepared. Both the screen and the 10 by 10 has been washed um, and sanitized. i got to turn off the phone here. Hold on, i got to pause. Trial and error, folks. Um, that Using the little holes on the top really is taking quite a bit of time so I'm gonna just open it if I can do this one-handed and just going to pour it see I've got a tray with holes and then I have a tray that can hold some water it's not very much water um, we'll see how this works and I'll just pour it on the tray Let's go ahead and get it started. Ain't gonna hurt nothing. Okay, now this is broccoli. No, 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 no. This is um Chinese cabbage, I believe. Salad mix had broccoli in it. Hold on. So I um took them and poured the water from the container into with the seeds into the tray and then I took my handy dandy spatula tiny little thing and carefully um, spread them out like peanut butter and jelly now the water is still in the tray and that's easy to dump that's not a, not a problem yes I will lose a few seeds but not too many um, the next time I go to do this I will be using my inoculant spray bottle so um, the screen will hold these tiny seeds into the tray and um, you can already see I've got some sprouters here in the cabbage uh, the Chinese cabbage um, which is awesome so again these seeds soaked overnight in um, just water nothing else and uh, tonight, um, it's about 10 o'clock in the morning, tonight they'll get the inoculant spray. Brent does an inoculant spray on his screen. Um, I'm going to try it this way first because it was just so much easier to pour the seeds with the water into the tray and do the inoculant tonight. I'm going to drain the green tray here in just a second. And there won't be any more standing water in the green tray. 
so the seeds which can float a little bit right now uh, will be nothing but soaked um, they'll still be wet oh, hold on so anyway so I got them on my rack I'm gonna put a covering tray on the cabbage and um, I've got let's see that's mung beans I believe no that's squash I got some squash seeds that I have from what we've eaten and this will be should be mung beans get my eye teeth to find another contraption like this it's really cool it's got a strainer inside the rubber made container I need to find another one like that so these are the previous salad greens using the medium you can see the medium the felt and um, you see my wheat grass growing oh look at this isn't that gorgeous just look at that Woo! smoothies and that's some more um, I think they have too much water in them, but I'm going to let them dry out today. They won't get water today because they're so heavy. That's probably the problem with these guys falling over like that. I think they're getting overwatered. And there was a bit of um, misfire on the growth. You know, some areas grow quicker than the others. And then in the back there, I've got another one of these. In fact, I have another one of these going to come out today. Um, she's under there with the lentils and everything. So, that's my growing so far. Enjoy your day.